Hello friends, today I'm going to show you how to service this lens and by that I mean how to open this lens and remove fungus from it and then the lens itself, I think it doesn't need presentation I will do it anyway it is the DC Nikkor 135mm f2 a lens that is just exquisite it, it is suited for almost any photographic application you will tell me, yeah, portraits, no, but anything else, I think it will do. Okay, and then what is the issue of this guy? I got it by my friend Fred, who got it from a guy who had it on his camera bag like for a few years without using it. And then the lens got what it seems to be fungus okay I think we see it better from the back let's try to take a look at that yeah you have all those fibers who are what it seems to be fungus or a ah, spider made the lens her home okay and then this lens is great and then you will love it even more because this lens it is also extremely simple to service and then I'm going to show you that immediately the trick is knowing that you have these two screws here so one here and then another one at 180 degrees and then usually on a regular lens this is my personal copy that I got also dirty but I clean it from the back and then here the screws are barely noticeable there's actually here one that you can see if you look for it okay, so like a lot okay here you go and then on the other side there is also second screw which is supposed to be here but it is almost impossible to see okay and then here on this copy there was just like a small black paint plug okay so what you have to do first is to find the position of the screws and then do as I show here So you scratch until you're able to get access to the screw slot and then once you have that I recommend you to make a mark here so you know the position where the screw should go when reassembling and then once you have done that you simply need to lose the screws just a bit and then with that and some crisp force you will be able to turn we just have removed the complete front element 
here you go and then you have fungus on this guy or dust you can simply clean it and then the second guy here you, found, you have here the defocusing mechanism so if you have work to do on it it will be simple to access and then or supposedly fungus or spider web is just behind here and then as you can see two holes to use a spanner or a mason compost compass will do so and you just need a bit of force Here you go. And then I take my traditional black glass and then here. We zoom a bit and then I will try to show you. What is supposed to be? fungus but doesn't seem to be sticking to the glass so it looks like a spider web and then here also on the body some of that so what I'm going to do is to go and grab my lens cleaning stuff and then we're going to remove that fungus so see you in a few seconds At the end we don't have to clean anything because that supposedly fungus was truly a spider web because prior to preparing everything for the clean I just came blew some air and then everything was gone. So if you're here for the fungus and then your lens truly has fungus you should take a look at this video showing here the cover and then the link in the corner and then there I show how to remove fungus from glass and then I also give the recipe that I use my own recipe to remove fungus and then this lens on the other hand we we'll just blow we will reassemble this lens reassembly is going to be as simple as the disassembly so first step here you have the defocusing mechanism I don't know if I mentioned that before and here to proceed with the reassembly we simply blow for any dust particle here you have a washer that I recommend that you put here before just put it in the right direction even if it doesn't change anything so I blow the front element I blow here I cover immediately to avoid any dust coming in again and then here just make sure it screws properly then my cue would be that I am close to the mark I make I made in the beginning then I make sure the screw is aligned with that then I put these small screws in again I 
and then we're good the lens is good for many years to come and then if you found one with fungus or you had yours with fungus now you will be able to enjoy it even more so this is all i wanted to show today thanks for watching and see you next time